Hello, this is Lady Jamers, and today's video is basically about cats. Um, about the cats I've had in my life and the Wissa cats. Um, and first of all, I want to tell you um, I have some SD shops I want to uh, say for the items I have on. I have Haunted Mansion. Here is says girl on the tightrope. Says foolish mortals, and then on the bottom you can get uh, custom. Right here, I got them to say haunted mansion. And the short is from Rose Michelle Studio um, on SD. It's very very nice quality and a uh, very very nice price it the shirt was around uh 15 16 dollars and you can get it in different colors um the ears the haunted mansion ears are from uh mickey's magic 28 my friend uh meg makes them she has an sd shop also um and the pin that i added to it is from abby cat crafts um i i thought the pin just made that little bit of oof to finalize everything and then i realized when i'm um, i'm sitting here with my hair on you can hardly see the pin so i thought to show you everything here is two pictures of the girl on the tightrope which actually i got the ears first and then the pin and then the shirt so i basically got the shirt to match the ears <laughs> and they also have the other people from the stretching room on here and here's the back of the ears and this guy right here um, they had Haunted Mansion pins. I wanted this pin so bad. And I tried a couple of times on eBay or in other stuff to get them. And I kept on being outbid. Um, but talking about eBay, I wanted to get... Yeah, I knew this would happen. <laughs> but anyway, I wanted to get... Um, Burloose because uh, he's one of my favorite Aristocats and I saw this pin let's see if I can get it without him going uh, all like there focus I mean everybody goes like this to focus does that actually work <laughs> but anyway um, he's a puzzle piece and I thought why don't I get the whole puzzle? Uh, I usually don't get the, um, you know, I love the mystery boxes as you have noticed, but I usually don't get the whole set because I don't really care about getting the whole set. As long as I have one or so pins representing uh, what I like, I'm happy with it. And... Watch, this time it will fall. Okay, here is the whole set. Um, like I said, there are two chasers that you can get with this. Um, I didn't get them, partly because the price, and partly because I couldn't find one of them. And uh, so I would spend all the money uh, getting, uh, let's see, there is eight nine out of the ten and then not finding the tenth and i i wanted the whole puzzle piece um what i want to do with this is i want to put it in a shadow box and uh put it along with this picture this pin from the couple set and this pin i showed you before a uh, burloose and turloose my two favorite uh Arisa cats, and I also wanted to put a single one of uh, the three kittens. Here's Marie. 
here's Torlus. And um, still on the lookout for Burlus. Uh, I have found him, but he's kind of pricey. Um, so if anybody wants to do a trade for like a Burlus in like one of these two sizes, uh, contact me. Uh, you can DM me on uh, Instagram at Lady Jamers or just put a comment below. And I'm going to anchor it with this pin over here that I got. I thought this, the puzzle, and the three kittens, uh, and plus this pin, uh, would be a very nice inner shadow box. Um, also, just to show you on the Disney cat theme, I had to get this. I saw it on Jenna Resort TV One's uh, stream uh, a couple months ago, and I had to get it. And it is not useful. Not because it's small. Small doesn't bother me. He has a little bit of furry face, and uh, you don't want to mess up his white fur. Uh, when you're using it for everyday use. So he's great for when you go to the parks. He's great for a costume party or or whatever like that. And I did see on another YouTube just the other day, he is still in the parks because um, I like to watch all the uh, shopping videos. They are my favorite, just to tell you. And here's the inside. He's striped, has uh, some credit cards. So if you don't want to put your wallet in there, you can just stick in the credit cards. And there's room for your phone, your car keys. So yeah, he's perfect evening bag um, if you want to show your crazy cat love. And hey, I am a proud crazy cat lady. Um, and talking about cats, um, I have, uh, let's see, I had Ar Archie, Jake, Charlie, and Albert uh, in my life. And they were all orange tabbies, kind of like Trollus right here. And um, here is a picture of Jake. Um, I had Jake and Elizabeth at the same time. Elizabeth actually picked me. Now, she did not say, pick me, pick me, over here, over here. As people who have cats know, they tell everything with their expression and their paws. She was saying, over here, over here, had her paw out of the cage, going over here. We're just using the paw movement. And I'm here like, okay. And she, she was so sweet. Um, she died at 17 of a kitty stroke, but she's very much a diva. And she, I remember her forever. She was half Maine Coon. Uh, I also want to say that if I do get another cat again, it's not going to be for like hers because when she turned to be a senior citizen, she did uh, want to groom herself. I nicknamed her Matt Girl uh, because she got all these mats. <laughs> so, um, if you have seen my Instagram and uh, Facebook pages, uh, you will see that I recently uh, lost my cat Archie. Uh, Archie died mainly of old age and everything and um, I promised my my mom that I wouldn't get another cat and uh, at first it was really really hard and um, basically there are uh, some things that I will miss uh, about having a cat and there are other things I don't miss and some things, like this picture right here, 
or double-edged sword. Getting on the table and knocking down your Christmas uh, decorations on the table. Um, this is Archie and um, he, I took so many pictures of him that he would actually pose. Uh, I have, um, have him with a, what is it? Oh, the Christmas tree from uh, two years ago. Uh, he was playing around with, believe it or not, one of the uh, Mickey uh, figurines I had there. And, um, yeah, right here. And uh, also one of the Flintstones ones. This is him at the uh, Christmas tree. I had this as my uh, Christmas card picture for last year. Um, he was very, very smart for a cat. Uh, he would actually listen and obey, which is very, very unusual. Um, I was telling my mother today that partly one of the reasons I think that he obeyed the way he did and, and listened is that I got him when he was like five weeks old. Now, him I got at a pet shop. Uh, like I said, my my family got him for me for Christmas in 2002. Um, and uh, they, uh, he was so tiny that um, I had to get the special little glass bowl for him. And um, he adored that glass bowl. And you would think um, I had it up on the counter one time and um, he was doing cat things about to knock it down. And I said, you don't want to knock that down. It's your favorite. And he stepped back. And, you know, like I said, the, the bowl out survived him, which shocked me. Um, so I've noticed that even though I don't have a cat anymore, I am still and always will be a crazy cat lady. Cats will. And uh, especially these two guys. Uh, so thank you for listening and watching my video. As always, like, subscribe, and tell your friends. And remember, cats rule. Bye-bye. Have a nice day.